Hebrews Day this year is being commemorated under the theme Honouring Our Martyrs, Heroes and Heroines. The festivities took place today in Omofia, Shikoto region. Amongst other dignitaries and guests, about 120 former freedom fighters were in attendance. NBC presenter John Ikonja engaged one such freedom fighter, Rear Admiral Sinsi Bamba of the Namibian Navy, and spoke on the importance of this day. Let's have a look. Well, uh, thank you so much for having us uh, coming to you uh, live from uh, that is in Omuthia in Oshikoto region for the 34th commemoration of Heroes Day. And uh, the event just concluded a while ago with having a lot that has been said on, of course, what Namibia is, of course, trying to celebrate. And also the president of the Republic of Namibia also spoke earlier, uh, just emphasizing that even though the country has been free for 34 years, more still need to be done for the benefits to be, of course, celebrated uh, for those to benefit from the from the from those that have sacrificed their lives for what we are celebrating today which is the independence now this uh, of this evening we are joined by the uh, rear admiral retired uh, since Simbambang Ipandwa to just talk to us about his time uh, during the time of the liberation struggle those take us back into time and also test tell us a story to what has been happening and what also is the importance of celebrating this day a very good afternoon thank you so much for making the time to talk to us rear admiral yeah, thank you very much, uh, NB Presenda. Thank you very much, Namibia. Um, you know, history uh, are made by people. Yeah. And uh, 26 August uh, well, is a very important day in the annal of Namibian history. Yeah. So this is the moment and the day and time probably our forefather took a very hard decision, uh, which was not easy to take. To, to, to take because you know first Swapo when started to, to wage the war for national liberation struggle it started to be a peaceful you know demand of independence but the ones uh, the Swapo of Namibia realized that no the Boer doesn't understand any other language so something have to be done so that uh, we force them out yeah that was on the basis of that uh, our forefathers uh, on, 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 on that basis, on the 26th of August, 1966, uh, uh, opened the first shot at, at, at the enemy troops at Omuru Wambashi. You know, uh, they come all a long way from Tanzania, they cross Zambia, cross the uh, Zambezi River, and also Kwandu River, and up to when they come and organize themselves to set up a base at, uh, at, at that place called Omuru Wambase. Absolutely. Talk, talk to us perhaps about some of the heroes and heroines you can remember uh, back during your time uh, in the liberation struggle and perhaps how, how important it is to also acknowledge them. Yes, uh, Namibian heroes and heroines are many. Uh, you know, I recall the names like the Tobias Ainyeko, Name like uh, the uh, Nakada Tashia Wilbert, the Pondo Isaac, uh, the Enias Peter Nanyemba, uh, the Greenwell Matongo, uh, the Helena Fidi, uh, yeah, and many, many of them. Yeah. Perhaps your message to the young people who may not fully understand how important it is for us to celebrate this day every 26th of August every year. What is your message to the young people? Yeah, you know, uh, people uh, um, people commemorate days for 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 specific reason, and for for this one, uh, 26 August or Muru Wombase, is very much important for us because that. Uh, uh, give us memory of what had happened and uh, why it had happened and what the day has caused to Namibia like we are enjoying independence today and if if you are not commemorating this day I think uh, we, 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 we are just uh, it, it look like a kind of betrayal because this day cost Namibians a lot so they, they you know they they shed their blood and uh, they also sacrificed their life so that uh, all of us who are here today can can you know can celebrate can be free can be independent and uh, we can develop namibia for the, for that matter Absolutely. That was Rear Admiral, the retired uh, Sinsi Bambang Ipando, just talking to us about, of course, the significance of this event. Also taking us back into time, also just mentioning some of the few heroes and heroines that he remembers from his time. 
Oh, thank you so much, John. When we come back after this.